Hi, my name is Ruben from Sharpening Tech, and this is just a, a, a video for the pet groomers. Something that probably will help you a lot. Let me start with the clipper blade, okay? The clipper blade has this little two ears right here. You can see it on the side, this and this. Now, there is also an opening that you have to see in this arc right here, which is right there. See that little loop right there? Has to be very clear. This sock, this part of the socket doesn't supposed to be bent in, but you will have some problems. Okay. So the other thing is, if you can see right there. This and this are kind of like open. This one is bent out. The other one is just a little bit. This one is a little more uh, way out of the, the alignment. So the problem you're going to have is we call it the blade will bark, you know, because this is for pet groomers. But um, this right here will start making a lot of noise and they move a lot. See? See how they move? They don't supposed to move, but they will make a lot of noise though. Okay, the other thing is, what I will recommend you is to uh, put some lube, some grease right there, when you replace your uh, drive. You know, you have to change that like every two, three months, depending on the, in the business that you have. So the other thing uh, I would also recommend to do, is to get one of these tools that will take care of your problem. We make these tools right here and the only thing you need to do is grab them right here and then squeeze and that will fix the problem in your ears right there. If it needs a little more then you just give it a little more squeeze right there and that if you can see it's ready to go now it will straighten without damaging anything and uh, at least once a month you probably want to check your uh, also your um, your screws right here you know make sure it's the whole hinge is tight and everything so after you fix that and this part of the um, of the um, spring is clear you just put it on and test it and the whole noise stops and the blade doesn't move anymore see? so this little trick probably can save you a lot of money um, when the blade is loose and moving a lot it will damage the lever with the drive and also it will force the bearing and obviously the whole motor right there you know so it's probably better to service your clipper at least um, once or twice a year the bearing uh, I've seen bearings uh, bad bearings for like you know six months old depending on the business that you have already so if you guys want to get this too you can call me um, or leave a message 916-550-0012 Thank you very much and good luck, okay? And uh, you can subscribe to Facebook at Sharpening Tech and Facebook um, to get more uh, free videos. Alright, good luck.